I am fortunate enough to really have the dream job where I get to see patients, do research and new discoveries to help better treat the patients that we serve. I get to teach the next generation of researchers and clinicians, and I get to advocate using what we know from our research and clinical work to get better care for our patients. Dr. Kim Karras demonstrates how research and science inform clinical practice and lead to improved quality of care and client and family well-being. Since earning her PhD in clinical psychology from York University in 2008, Dr. Karras has demonstrated an outstanding track record in building regional, provincial, and national research in clinical collaborations and partnerships. It's what I always wanted to do. It was just something I've been interested in and I don't think I ever had another career choice besides being a psychologist and besides wanting to be a psychologist who both helped patients and did research to find ways to help even more patients. She is considered a leader in the area of concurrent mental health and addictions clinical research. This resulted in her recruitment as the Director of Research and Program Development in the Substance Use and Concurrent Disorders Program at the Royal and as a clinician scientist at the Royal's Institute of Mental Health Research, proudly affiliated with the University of Ottawa. The patients that we see really are the cornerstone of what we do. And it's those patients that help us develop research questions and research projects. Um, they inform our research work and then the research that we do helps inform the clinical work we do. So I don't actually see it as either you're a clinician or you're a researcher. In fact, they're so interconnected in one informing the other in this feedback loop, I don't see how I could separate one from the other. Dr. Karras's research, clinical, teaching, and advocacy efforts have had an enormous impact on the lives of people in our community. Her numerous research activities have led to sustainable improvements in mental health and addiction care, better client outcomes, and reduced stigma. She inspires hope in clients and families. We know silo treatment, where you get treatment for one thing or another thing, just doesn't work. And we know treating things integrated so all things at once by a collaborative team of professionals in a coordinated way gives best outcomes for our patients and their families. Her work is a credit to the Royal, gives impetus to the research community, and is a catalyst to improve the mental health and addiction system. It is incredibly rewarding, I have to say. Very rewarding to do the work I do in this area. But what really inspires me, um, it's the patients and their families that we see.